got eight, eight, nine packs left, it looks like. About nine acres or so. So we'll finish up here tonight. Hopefully we've got a toy coming in the morning. We'll try and get, get that out when I get off work tomorrow. And we've been running here. Michael's been gone. We've got our his sales associate Jordan running the green cart today and we got trucks from Ag Partners hauling for us along with two other trucks, two other two other trucks. Um, but yeah, the, the end is in sight for Harvest 2021. Talking about two years ago when we were up here on corn, how cold it was, probably we got to, what did it get to, negative, it get to the negatives oh, yeah, overnight. Like, yeah, it like it did. Below. So in the day it got a little better, but it was it was frigid. I was in insulated bibs and we were stocking capped up coats. So we finished we finished up in the morning that day. I skipped class to, to be here, but it turned out that class got canceled anyway, so it was okay. And we parked the the night before we finished up, we parked our, our equipment on a friend of ours up, up his way, some farthest away farms. So we parked our stuff up there, plugged it in overnight. It was still hard to start. This is a much much smoother end of, end of harvest. Hopefully, we'll be getting into into some some tillage, strip tillage with our new toy coming tomorrow, and that'll be about it for the for the year. Expensive toy. Expensive, real expensive toy. Yeah, I'm 
loading auger, a shaft, a bolt and washer to retain the shaft in place. So there it is, only a couple raccoons coming out. Toy, new toy. Stella doesn't know what to think of the thing. Pretty cool. We'll come back later and get a better look at her. Speaking of toys, holy cow, wouldn't it be cool if this was our new toy? X9 1100. That might be a bit much. It's fresh off the demo runs and sold, so not a bad looking little combine here. See how comfy cozy it really is. <whistles> nice, nice. Uh oh, Capcorn. That's a pretty cool little machine. Unfortunately, it's not coming home with me, but uh, you know, farm kid can dream, I guess. Dad even got her all shined up and pretty just to get dirty again. Here's a good look down the back of the machine. Still trying to kind of figure out the hoses and everything. It's kind of a different animal. That's what they make operators manuals for. Yo. Hi, Garrett. Sort off a group of hogs. Let's go. Fun way to end the day. Ho ho ho. Hey. Finally reached the phase in uh, the year where I don't wear shorts to the barns. So I wear jeans and I suffer for it because it's hot in the barns, but it's cold outside. And I don't like being cold outside. You need to find a good happy medium and stick to that. Well, with that, I think that's everything for this video. Thanks for watching, guys. Be sure to make, leave a comment, like, subscribe. Thanks. Have a good one.